appreciate God's creation and Mother Nature and say that we are confident that with their ongoing raids, we will restore our climate, we will restore our livelihoods, we will grow more food and we will attain food security. I want to urge all the people around this area to continue preserving this forest because this forest is our lifeline. It has seen us through for many years and I have no doubt in my mind that once we continue with this preservation, God being gracious, giving us rain, this forest will continue to be a blessing to the people not just of this region but the whole country. Uh, we thank God this morning, walking through deep into the North Kenya forest where we were born and brought up. Came on the connection journey to this forest. The biggest water catchment area in the south this region. And we are grateful to God for the rains. We are so happy that our river is back. You can hear the sound of the Pasadena. You can see the way the trees are blowing. And this is a sign of life. We really want to thank God for the rains and we pray for continued rains so that we can continue to serve in this forest as a water catchment area. Again, I want to thank the people of this area for preserving this forest. As you can see, this indigenous forest is intact. And I want to urge all other Kenyans to pay the call of the William Ruto to plant and grow 15 million trees by the year 2032. It's the only way to mitigate the effects of climate change. This is a good reconnection for me. Given that my parents, the great mother to live the Shango and the generation of the Shango, spent years in this forest fighting for the liberation of this country. This forest is a reminder that with lessons, with commitment, with resource, human beings can achieve their freedom and whatever they desire. It therefore encourages me that the next liberation, the economic liberation of this country, God and the people of Kenya have given me the opportunity to assist President William Ruto in the next liberation, the economic liberation of this country. Thank you. The sound of the much waters and the greenery around is a testimony that God answers prayers. Those who do not believe, let them hear the sounds of the water, let them see the greenery of the forest, and it is a reminder that God still answers uh, prayers and God is on the throne. Thank you.